how to solve common marriage problems. Even happy married couple faces problems in their marriage. There are many common problems in marriage life and it can be avoided. Hello mga ka gorgeous, welcome back once again to my vlog. I hope you're all in great condition at this time. Anyway, in today's video mga ka gorgeous, we're going to talk about common marriage or marital problems that needs to be solved. Okay? So as a married couple, in my opinion, once you turn your back in your relationship when you encounter marital issues, it will quickly fall apart. So I have two steps that maybe you can apply in our personal marriage life. So sit back, relax, and enjoy. Step number one, communication. This is one of the common problems in the relationship. See guys, every time I have this kind of topic, communication is always there, right? Because it is so important in every relationship. If you don't have any communications at all, how are you going to know what is going on with each one of you in your household, work, or any kind of activities out there? right that's why it's, it is very very important step number two money as much as possible guys couples shouldn't be fighting over money in order to avoid problems about money is when it comes to budgeting you guys have to be in the same page okay so meaning don't hide income or outcome or any kind of debts decide which person will be responsible for paying the monthly bills in any relationship there is always a spender and a saver right so who is the spender or the saver here raise your hand so step number three trust trust is a key part of a relationship any issues in the past that prevent you from trusting others? In order to develop trust in each other, do the following. Do what you say you will do, okay? So be fair even in the middle of an argument. Never say things you can't take back. Respect each other's boundaries and be a good listener. Step number four, expectations. Alternatively, guys, couples sometimes struggle to meet each other's expectations because the other don't know what the other one expects from them in the relationship. The best thing to do is not to expect to avoid disappointment, okay? It's your responsibility to share your expectations with your partner and be very clear about it. Step number five unsupportive partner guys another common problem is when a partner is unsupportive of goals and interests lalo na dito sa yt dapat supportado din tayo ng mga spouses natin di ba or sa relasyon you want them to follow their dreams and will do anything to support them another thing guys is step number six cheating or infidelity there is a lot of forms of infidelity nowadays, guys, with all different, you know, sites as simple as downloading an app and all. Cheating is a huge issue in a relationship. If you have someone outside your marriage, then it's a huge issue that can damage relationship. Step number seven, boredom. This one is a common problem in a long-term relationship, okay? So especially when you are with the same person for many years, you know, it seems that the sparks are not there anymore. So <gasps> need to reconnect with our partner, you know, try to plan to do things together like travel or do a long drive. The important is to have a bonding moment, you know, make it fun and exciting. Step number eight sexual and intimacy as the years go by parang nawawala na ang excitement dito di ba maybe because of as we grow older we have our own different priorities na di ba that's why sometimes it becomes one of the issue in the relationship 
So up to us how we are going to spice things up. But the bottom line is be grateful for the person you get to lay your head down next to. Keep it, guys. Step number nine, lying. Lying is a common marriage problem. It's not only restricted to infidelity or selfishness, it is also comprises white lies about day-to-day -day things. This is something that is hard to win, as in, for example, you already caught someone lying, but they are still insisting that they are not lying, so they just lied again for saying they did lie. Best thing is to just be honest with each other so you don't have to feel guilty about anything. And step number 10, not consulting each other. By consulting them or your partner is also showing respect, right? When you have a partner in life, it's only common sense to let your partner that they are a priority to you by consulting them before you make any kind of decision. So decision on whether to take a new job or whatnot, especially on a big decision. That's why we have a partner so we can consult things with each other. Okay, now the gorgeous, let's do a recap. Number one, communication. Two, money or finances. Three, trust. Four, expectation. Five, unsupportive partner. Six, cheating or infidelity. Seven, boredom. Eight, sexual or intimacy. Nine, lying. And number 10, not consulting each other. So how do you guys solve your own common marriage problems? So please let me know in a comment section below. And thank you guys for watching, okay? So I hope somehow I was able to give you some helpful information in today's video. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell for more of my upcoming videos. I'll talk to y'all later, guys. Have an awesome day. Bye.